Good day to all of the automotive enthusiasts from all walks of life. This is the Barn Industry Design Channel, where we take you through some of the latest automotive design content in the industry. Today, we will be emphasizing a section of Auto Design's bi-monthly magazine, Volume 262, story called A Strong Gust of Wind by Sylvia Badovaldi. No questioning that 2020 was a special year for the entire planet. But at Renault, it will be remembered above all for the breath of fresh air that swept through the company with the arrival of new CEO Luca De Mayo and the unveiling of his Renault strategic plan. In the ensuing organization by Brand Shakeup, Lawrence Vandenacre was appointed Executive VP for Design at the Renault Group, thus heading up the four Renault, Dacia, Alpine, and Mobilize Studios. 2020 also saw the arrival of Giles Vidal to run Renault's brand design at a time when DeMeo was stressing the need for a broader portfolio of C&D segment models, including a new flagship to be built immediately. That's where the Rafale came from, a blast of fresh air that took on material form. Its name says it all, a reference to the world of aeronautics and historic Cordon Renault Rafale, a record-breaking aircraft that reached 445 kilometers an hour in 1934. We started from a blank sheet of paper to create the new top of the range car based on the CMFCD platform, says Vidal, whom we met at Le Bourget on the occasion of the car's debut at the last Paris air show. First, we created an original SUV coupe silhouette, as new in form as in design language, made up of generous curves combined with taut lines and technical details. We then worked on the proportions, wide tracks, a long bonnet ending in a vertical front end, large diameter wheels, and of course, a highly sculpted and sharp fastback rear to guarantee aerodynamic efficiency. The front had to fit in with the role of the model, Vidal continued. It has a determined expression and we focus on all the details. The luminous signature of the daytime running lights refers to the Lojing of our logo and thus directly to the brand, as on the new Clio. The sloping grill motif, which hides a blue background, is also inspired by the Lojing. The texture varies depending on the point of view, as if it were animated. It is extraordinary with the car in motion. It is one of the elements that generate a magical effect, an aspect that responds to Luca De Mayo's request to the designers to bring magic back to cars. The Rafale is one of a triptych of cars flanked by the Astral and Espace, with which it shares the interior, but its design was initiated later and its silhouette is complete specific as are the surface treatments which follow the new codes, explains Agnetsa Dahlgren, director of design projects for segment C and D. It had to become the flagship, at once bold and visionary, if you want to be visible in a fiercely competitive market with new brands coming in practically every day, you need a design that stands out in the crowd. We played a lot on two levels, marrying the premium aspect of sportiness with dynamic and sculptural lines. As always, the teamwork with the engineers was fundamental both for the aerodynamic efficiency of the car body and for the unexpected creases the sheet metal takes on at the sides. To mark the lines with precision, you also have to make progress in terms of pressability, and we gave our technicians a lot of work in this sense. They responded exceptionally. Innovative as it is in its design language, the Rafale is no less when it comes to the materials in the cockpit, where we encounter slate and cork, uncommon for a generalist brand, observes Dahlgren. The cork is dyed deep black, while the slate is treated with a peeling technique to obtain a very thin layer which with certain materials are covered. In particular, the hand rests on the central tunnel. Where you touch it, you feel real stone. As designers, we are proud to have been able to achieve this. And then, in the Esprit Alpine trim on the backrest, there is the A that lights up with a sequence that pulsates like a heartbeat. It is a sign of our passion for cars. If you like our content, please share and subscribe as we continue highlighting the latest trends of the automotive industry. Take care and stay enthusiastic about your passion.